Rihanna inspired up to for you guys today. And I know it's not it's not a recent hairstyle she had. It had to be like a year or two ago. I'm really not sure. But um, I'll link it somewhere down here so you guys can see. I'm sure when you see it, you'll know what I'm talking about. I wanted to do like a easy prom, but something really easy, you know, prom up to that you guys can, um, will be able to do at home. And um, I saw this and I was like, wow, that I know that I can make that really easy to teach you guys. So yeah, if you guys want to learn how to get this look, keep watching. Use any kind of curling method you like, um, whichever you feel, you know, looks best, whatever, whichever one you want to pick, it's totally up to you. Um, you just want to make sure you do add texture to your hair because it's definitely not going to work and look the same with straight hair. So, okay. Get a scrunchie, preferably one that matches your hair if you can. And put your hair in a ponytail. And whatever falls down, just let it fall down. Right? If you want to pick out some pieces, you can, but just try to let it be a little bit natural. Whatever falls down, just let it kind of fall down, you know? Alright, so, and if you want, you could you could tease this, you know, tease up here just to get a little bit more volume, but I want to leave it like that because I kind of, I don't want to take out, uh, brush out the curl in my hair. So, okay. Um, you want to do the ponytail pretty high. Um, I think that's good. This is good. So just secure it. And make sure it's, you know, tight and secure because you don't want it to be loose or falling down. Alright. So now, what you want to do, have your bobby pins ready. And again, preferably ones that match your hair color. And all you want to do is kind of push it up and pin. And that's it. Just kind of take, push up randomly. You don't have to be perfect in any way. So just kind of push the hair up. Okay? and pin it. Just make sure you're looking in the mirror. You can kind of see what you're doing. You want it to look kind of messy, kind of like it's, the hair is coming down, but you don't want it to be falling down. Big difference. I don't have a lot of headbands, so I don't have much to choose from, but I just kind of want to give you a visual and let you like see kind of how you can style it, you know. Definitely if it's like for prom, you could get one of those headbands that have like little beads on them or sparkly, shiny, you know, something to match your dress, a flower, you know, but, and you, if you have a headband like this, you should do it before. Now I hope I don't mess it up. Okay. Okay. I don't want to mess it up. Okay. Ah. Yeah, if you have a headband like this, you shouldn't even use a headband like this because you don't want to mess it up. But I don't have much headband to choose from because I'm not really a headband girl. So I just just want to give you guys a visual kind of how to style it. Okay. So you could leave it like that, or you could kind of, you know, pin this over, you know, something like that. It's really up to you, you know. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. This hairstyle is so easy and achievable. You know, some it's something so cute and simple, but at the same time can be really elegant and formal. So, yeah, let me know what you think, and I'll see you next time. Bye!